Hey guys, it's Krista with Saddlebox, and for today's video, I'm gonna be giving you some tips for selling your horse. So when selling your horse, it's always very important to consider how you can create the best outcome for that horse, for the person buying the horse, and obviously for yourself as well. So you want to maintain professional, especially if you are you know, selling higher dollar horses. So you always wanna keep a professional relationship with the person who you are selling the horse to. Um, this may be through, you know, if you want to create a buyback contract, I know some people want to do that. I always recommend doing a bill of sale to protect yourself, the buyer, um, and it just keeps things organized and professional. Um, and just taking into consideration, you know, how they will be getting the horse. Are they going to be transporting the horse? Are you going to help them with that? Um, is that something you're willing to do? Think about Coggins, um, health certificate. It, it's a lot to consider. So. Um, as a seller, you may not necessarily have to do as much as the buyer, but you still should accommodate and help. Okay, and another thing to consider when selling your horse, um, when you are in the process of selling, you want to know your market. So always ask yourself, you know, who would be best with this horse? Who is the ideal owner for this horse? Um, and that will, a lot of times will help you be a better seller because then if somebody comes to look at the horse and you just kind of know like, this may not be the best outcome you can you know influence that and tell the person who's interested or you know you can see hey this is probably going to be the best outcome for this horse and owner so some places you can post a horse for sale include obviously all social media platforms there's a few that are specifically for equines like equine now dream horse barrel horse world those are some big ones um there are also some reputable auctions that you should consider as well um, and especially, you know, as a seller, you want to consider some good auctions, always do reviews, um, you know, check it out because we don't want, you know, these horses ending up in slaughterhouses, obviously, which is a thing that can happen if you, you know, send them to an auction without knowing, you know, the type of buyers or, you know, potentially where this horse could end up. So, um, always be aware of those things and just be sure that you are, very confident in where you are sending your horse to be sold off. All right, y'all, that's it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.